If you're watching something on your TV, but the Apple TV remote keeps popping up on the iPhone lock screen, it can be pretty frustrating. I'm gonna walk you through some steps to get that disabled. Now, it looks sort of like this. You can see in this just example, at the very bottom, it has these options, lounge, Buffalo Bills, and you can see the Apple TV remote. Now, the first thing that I would recommend doing is heading into the settings app on your iPhone. So after you've opened up the settings app, let's go to your Apple TV settings. So scroll to the very bottom and tap on apps at the very bottom. From here, you're going to scroll down until you get to the section for TV. So find TV on this list and then tap on it. And the first thing we'll do is tap on live activities towards the top. This allows your phone, basically an Apple TV to show and display live activities, including the remote. So let's toggle this off and this off as well. Now check to see if this fixes it. If it doesn't fix it, let's go back to the very beginning of your settings here. So go back to the beginning of your settings. And from here, you can see general midway down. Just tap on the general option. And now from here, you can see airplay and continuity midway down. T tap on that option here. And you can see a bunch of different things. Now at the very top, it says automatically airplay, which a lot of times that Apple TV remote is airplay. You want to choose instead of automatic, either go to ask or in my case, I'll switch it to never because I want to just manually do that instead of it going through the process of always popping up saying, hey, do you want to control your TV using airplay or Apple TV? Now, after we've turned that off, let's go back to the beginning of your settings again and go to the notification settings. So from here, let's scroll down until you find notifications and tap on that. And now from here, you're going to find the Apple TV notifications. So scroll down again until you get to TV. Depending on whether you have that installed on your phone or not, it might show up. You can see it's not showing up for me. Basically, if you have that installed on your phone, then it'll show up on this list. Essentially, all you need to do is tap on it and then tap on allow notifications at the top to disable it. So you want to completely turn off notifications for that Apple TV. After we've done all of those things, let's go back to the very beginning of your settings again. Tap on the general option, scroll down to the bottom and just hit shut down. You'd be surprised how many times just turning your phone off and turning it back on fixes a ton of bugs and glitches on your iPhone.